Hey Tankers, Xander P here. Wargaming has just released new information about the update 1.12 and this time it will include some buffs to vehicles. On the list that was released, we can see M41D, the F1066 Senlac, the T92 and the Izu 130 as the chosen vehicles. Without further ado, let's see the list. On M41D, we can see that the view range will go from 390 meters to 410 meters and the reverse speed goes from 22 kilometers to 24 kilometers. This will be quite useful if you have a French playstyle. The top speed as well will be buffed from 65 kilometers per hour to 68 kilometers per hour. While the M41D received the buff in speed, we can spot on the FV1066 Sandlack got its accuracy from 0.38 to 0.35 and its free range from 400 meters to 410 meters. The T92 didn't have any changes to top speed or view range. This time the changes go to the shell penetration. While the standard shell penetration will go from 175 to 185, the special shell penetration will go from 210 to 230. Now let's talk about the ISO 130. The list for this one is big, the developers were definitely inspired on this one. ISO 130 got buffed on standard shell penetration from 215 to 238 and the special shell penetration from 187 to 212. There is a difference in damage between the standard shell that does 490 damage and the special shell that does 570 damage. We also got the standard shell velocity going from 898 to 960, while the HE shell velocity went from 702 to 850. And traverse angles went from minus 2 slash 10 to minus 10 slash 10. Finally, the ISO 130 will have a buff on the Spore engine going from 520 horsepower to an incredible 600 Mustang power. Specific power from 11.06 went to 12.8 and finally the ammo capacity went from 25 shells to 35 shells. With this last one, you'll finally be able to miss more shots without being concerned of running out of ammo. As a note provided by Wargaming, these changes are not final, some characteristics are subject to change.